All right, guys, what we're gonna do as promised in our last video where we was making the sausage is what I'm gonna do is make for you the ultimate venison breakfast sandwich. At least that's what I call it. Start out, we're gonna put it on some toast. So whatever type of bread you like, I like wheat. So uh, first off is let's go over here to the toaster and we're gonna toast us up some bread. Hell. While that bread's a going, I'm gonna preheat my skillet. Because what we're gonna do is I like to make my breakfast sandwich a full size of a sandwich. So I'm gonna make a venison sausage patty approximately a half a pound to three quarters of a pound. I want a, I want a good size patty. Pro I'll probably stick more with a half a pound because it is getting late in the afternoon. <laughs> and I, I don't want to get too full for supper. But anyway, let's uh, get this thing heated up and we'll get a sausage patty in there and see how it turns out. All right, guys, what I've done here is I got a, about a half a pound patty that I've made up with my consistency of 50% pork and 50% venison. And I'm gonna brown that baby up. You see that's a good size patty. It will shrink up some. I want you to look at that boy, how that's holding together. Guys, you can see that uh, if you got enough fat consistency there, you're going to have some in the pan. And if you see that you need more, don't hesitate to put a little bit of vegetable oil in there to just help it cook and make it, make it moist. And guys, so far I've got my toast done and my sausage is on its way to being done. That's two of the ingredients. There's going to be two more ingredients before we're done. But you want to talk about something awesome, man. You can take these right here and make several of these up a week and uh, for work or something like that. Saves you a lot of time on a breakfast and a lot better for you too. Which I raised my own eggs here at the house, so that's going to be one of the ingredients that you haven't seen yet. I'll go ahead and give you the other one. It's cheese, so... As soon as this sausage is done, we'll get back with you. That way you can see the rest of it. All right guys, that sausage is about done. And of course you can make your toast as dark as you want it. All right guys, the next step is we're gonna, gonna cook us an egg. And I cleaned out my, my oil from the sausage because and what I'm doing here is just going to put me down a little slab of butter there. And just cook up that egg. I like my eggs over easy. You make your egg however you like it. Alright guys, flip that egg over. Look at that fanciness. <laughs> I got a little bit of eggs. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm going to plate this up. Put me a little bit of salt. pepper and my cheese guys in my opinion that is what I'd call the ultimate breakfast sandwich Take that right there, pick it up, 
See that guys? That is some count. I promise you if you try it, you're gonna love it. Um, just because I made it the way I did don't mean you have to. If you like your eggs hard cooked, scrambled, whatever. But in my opinion, I love the yolk. Gives you something extra to kind of dip that in, run it around. So good guys, so good. But uh, as always, I left half here for my cameraman. I always do. That way he can try it. But as always, we appreciate you guys watching. Hope you like this recipe. Give it a shot. Uh, Cause I believe you're a little fall in love with it. Because if you like breakfast as much as I do, and you like wild game and venison as much as we do, at least give it a shot. Guys, thanks for watching and God bless.